You may have heard of terms such as worms, viruses, trojans, or ransomware when people discuss cybersecurity. These are nothing more than different types of programs cyber attackers use to infect computers and devices. A common term used to describe all these different programs is the word malware. Simply put, malware is software that is used to perform malicious actions. In fact, the term malware is a combination of the words malicious and software. Cyber attackers try to install malware on your computers or mobile devices to gain control over them. Once installed, these attackers can use malware to spy on your online activities, steal your passwords and files, or use your system to attack others. For example, one type of common malware is called a keylogger. Once it infects your system, cyber attackers can use it to capture every keystroke you type, including your logins and passwords. Armed with that information, cyber attackers can then log into your accounts as you. Another example of malware is called ransomware. When ransomware infects your computer, it encrypts all of your files, including your documents, spreadsheets, and photos, locking you out and denying you access to them. The cyber attacker then demands you pay a ransom to decrypt your files to regain access to them. Even if you pay the ransom, you have no guarantee that you'll recover the files. If you don't want to pay the ransom or can't pay it, the only reliable way you can recover the files is from backups. If you do not have good backups, your data is gone. Many people have the misconception that malware is a problem only for Windows computers. While Windows is widely used and thus a big target, malware can infect any device, including Mac computers, smartphones, and tablets. In addition, many people mistakenly believe antivirus can detect and stop all malware. However, it can't. Cyber attackers are constantly developing new versions of malware that can bypass most antivirus software. This is why your security training is so important. Much of what we are teaching will help protect you from getting infected. Ultimately, your best defense against malware is common sense. If something seems odd, suspicious, or too good to be true, it may be a cyber attacker trying to infect your system. Yeah. <laughs>